Alright guys, uh, welcome to, well whatever, since this is a tutorial, I'm going to show you today uh, how to edit any single text file in the game. Now uh, what you want to do is you want to go to your localization folder, which is located on the Borderlands 2 menu, so you want to go to local disk C, program files, then go to Steam. Then go to Steam Apps, Common, uh, Borderlands 2, and you should be here. And you should go to Willow Game, and then Localization. This is where you'll find the base game items of the files. Now, of course, since uh, pretty much the game has uh, all the files inside of it already, so not everything is going to be in the international folder. So what you want to do is go to the ITA folder, which is basically another language file. You can choose any of these. ITA thing, and every single uh, text file is in here. As you can see, it's bigger and than the other one. Uh, and then you, you just want to grab any one of these. Uh, let's see, uh, for example, uh, let's go to the weapons part of it, like shotgun. Edit it. I'm, I'm using Notepad plus plus because um, because this is what I have. You can open it with still with Notepad by right clicking, but I use Notepad plus plus. It's a Good program. You can just go ahead and choose any of these. Uh, you gotta copy and paste it. Uh, basically, the, these are the files of, of the text inside of it. Like this is the values, everything. Uh, you gotta copy and paste the thing you're gonna edit. Let's see. I want to edit the dog. And then you want to go to Notepad, oh, paste it here, as you can see. Modify it here, like I don't know, cat for example. I don't know, and uh, and, and this part here is the red, what the red text is. You can just modify it to be whatever, really, like that. And then after you're done, you gotta save it as, and then you go to the same thing, just localization. You gotta go to the int folder where it is, and then you gotta. Basically, you rename it to the to the thing like the end. Basically, the name of the file which is located over here. Uh, you can't see my mouse because I don't know why. And then you rename it to basically it. You gotta select in all files as you can see. This with all end. And then you save it. Uh, the the reason why uh, I already have the file over here, so I don't. I'm not gonna save it. Uh, the reason why you're doing this is because you're basically recognizing. Uh, the game as um, basically you're you're telling it to a string to change it inside of the game files. Uh, you can do one because because uh, the game doesn't require all the files because it already has it in. So you can so you can basically do one line instead of all the file, and then you can just save it. I already have it saved, so we're not gonna do that. Um, and then another thing is, um, if you want DLC stuff, you gotta do, go to the DLC file. You can choose any one of them. If you know the DLC code, like Aster is Dragon Keep, uh, Orchard is Pirate. Yeah, th that's the Pirate DLC. And uh, yeah, basically that's how they go. Iris is Torg, and Sage is Hammerlock. Same, same concept. Same thing. Localization. Int as the int over here, and the ITA. And you can do this for everything. Uh, another thing to note is uh, this. I think I think this is a Digitruck Peak one. Yeah, this is the Digitruck Peak if you want to edit the new class one. This is the file. Hey, Talon, <laughs> way to pop up on my stream. Uh, yeah, and that's how you do it. Like I I appreciate you guys showing up, but this is why I have to end it because this is streamed by a really really high bit rate. Also. This is OBS <laughs> interception. Alright, well thank you for coming out and I'll catch you guys later.